How did you end up getting drafted by the Oakland Athletics? Yeah, I think, you know, it's an interesting thing about, you know, professional sports is is they have to choose you. You can't choose them, you know, mm-hmm. and, and so it's just a matter of, you know, as my, as my time here at Linfield as a player, just had, you know, opportunity to get on the field, continue to develop, get better, and, and um, you know, going into my junior year, I know there, I knew there was a number of scouts that were talking to me about, you know, professional baseball and, and possibly being drafted, and, and it just happened to be Oakland was the, the team that drafted me, and, and so... Um, like I said, that was something that, that I really want to do my whole life, and so it was um, once I got the opportunity, um, I was going to jump at it and, and, and take the shot. Excellent. So there wasn't a local scout that put you into contact or anything? Uh, you know, Carney, Coach Carnahan was oh. probably the guy who started. That's kind of the you know part of the role of the coaches as well, so if you have players on your team that you kind of call the scouts or, or talk to guys, say, hey, you know, maybe we have a guy here that's worth looking at. And I know um, Carney did that for me, that, that he had talked to Grady Fuson, who was the scout for the A's, hmm. and said, hey, we have a player here you might want to check out. And, and Grady came and watched me play a couple different times and, and uh, put my name in the draft. That's incredible. And you were drafted your junior year? I was, yeah. And you went to the Medford Athletics after that? Correct, yeah. yeah. So Medford A's, um, I kind of just you know, kind of poked my way through the, the system each year. So I was in rookie ball in, in 87, the, the year that I was drafted. Mm-hmm. In 1988, went to Madison, Wisconsin, and, and played out there. And oh, then wow. in 89 and 90, played in, Med- in uh, Huntsville, Alabama. Mm-hmm. And then in 1991, started the year with Tacoma and AAA, and then came up with Oakland um, for the second half of the year in 91. How would you describe your time at the Oakland Athletics? Uh, you know, a lot of learning, obviously, there. I mean, they, they were they were the, the team that drafted me, and, and so just, I, I think, in terms of, of just kind of that whole um, journey of going from rookie ball and kind of working your way through the minor leagues to getting to the big leagues, I mean, some very special times, you know, obviously making that big league debut. I mean, you look, for, you know, your whole life, you look forward to, to playing in the big leagues, and all of a sudden now it happens, and, and so that's something you never forget. And, and then I think, you know, some just some ups and downs there with the team, both in terms of personally and the team. When I came up, Oakland was a, a winning team. Um, you know, we were, they were a playoff contender, you know, pretty much every year. And then over the course of my time there, new ownership came in, and, and it, it kind of changed the direction of the team. So in my last three or four years, um, we weren't a winning team. So it was just kind of, kind of saw it all, kind of saw the good and the bad and everything in between my years there. Incredible. And then how was your experience with the athletics different from your experience with the New York Yankees? Uh, it was very different. I think, um, you know, number one, certainly there, there's a huge difference in playing in Oakland and in New York, you know. Um, like I said, Oakland is, is, is a big league city and it's a big league stadium, but there's really something very different about playing for the Yankees, you know. Um, you know, full ballparks every night instead of, you know, 8,000 people or 10,000 people, you know, on a weekday. Um, mm-hmm. Just so much attention on the team, so much expectations on it. Um, you know, for me, I was coming off a, a real tough, you know, my last year in Oakland, I had a really bad year personally in terms of, of my hitting and my health and things like that. And so for me, it kind of represented a fresh start and just an opportunity then that just to, like I said, play on a team that was a, a winning team.